to another episode on ASUG 12 exams. So in this episode, we are now looking at section B of the November 2022 Science Paper 2, which is Chemistry. So in section B, you are expected to answer all questions, and each question contributes towards the 45 marks. So it's important that you do well in this uh, section. So the only way you do well is by studying and revising as much as possible. Remember, revision helps you to know how questions come and cement things that you may not understand. So let us look at question B1. Give one reason why laboratory rules are very important. So laboratory rules are important because they help us to keep everyone safe and avoid accidents. That's the reason of laboratory rules. So helps us to keep everyone safe and avoid accidents while doing experiments. That's it, the purpose of laboratory rules. Roman number two state one importance of chemistry in our day-to-day -day life. So chemistry has a number of applications in our day-to-day -day lives. Among them is uh, medicine. So one, you can talk about medicine. So in the manufacturing of medicine, you use a chemistry. So medicine manufacturing use chemistry to mix substance in a correct proportion. So what you use is chemistry. So you mix this one chemically. Number two in agriculture. So in agriculture you use chemistry. So manufacturing of agricultural inputs. Manufacturing of agricultural inputs use a chemistry. So inputs like a fertilizer. So fertilizer you mix nitrogen, potassium and phosphorus. So you are mixing nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium to make compound D. D. So these are some of the key applications where chemistry is very important. So chemistry is very important because it's used in our day-to-day -day lives. Also in the industry such as in the case of Zambia mining a cement are created by using chemistry a principle to chemically bond certain elements so that to form a given product. So these are the key applications of uh, chemistry and making it very important to our day-to-day -day lives. Without these principles, we cannot manufacture medicine, you cannot manufacture fertilizer, you cannot extract copper and make key apparatus that you will use for our daily survival. Question B. The following graphs show heating caves that were drawn after pure ice and candle wax were heated over time to their melting points. Identify the heating cave for the candle wax and give reason of your answer. So, what we have, we have the eating caves. So these eating caves, so we have the pure ice and candle wax. So these are heated over time and then we have the melting point. So the question is, which one is for pure ice and which one is for candle wax? And how do these two differ? So pure ice is a pure substance and the pure substance has an exact boiling and melting point. Hence, if you look at this two, you know that this at this point exactly the ice must melt. 
because it's pure. So this should be a pure ice. Then tender wax is made up of a mixture of various hydrocarbons with different in number of uh, carbons and uh, lipids it is in. So because it's a mixture, it will have an uh, irregular melting point curve. So you notice that these are irregular. So this should be this garden candle wax. So candle wax is in X. So reasoning uh, because candle wax contains a mixture of various hydrocarbons with different number of carbons it is so because if you have differing hydrocarbons contained in those uh, mixtures that makes the candle wax is going to have an irregular melting point curve as shown by x so that's how you answer this uh, question Loma numero 2 of B give one effect of impurities on the melting and boiling points of a pure substance. So the effect is that uh, impurities increase the boiling point then reduce the melting point of the pure substance so maybe I just make it one sentence so impurities increase the boiling point and reduced the melting point of pure substance so impurities like here, that then contain impurities increase the boiling point and reduce the melting point of a pure substance because once you have impurities those impurities will take part of the places that's supposed to be taken by uh, the pure substance hence altering the boiling and melting point of that uh, particular substance so you end up having an irregular boiling points which is not exact that's the effect Thank you viewers for watching uh, this uh, episode. If you find this video to be helpful, please uh, consider liking and also if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing. By liking, subscribing and sharing, you are going to help us improve our visibility. A simple like from you makes a big difference. So once you subscribe to our channel and go to our channel, we discover that we've got uh, so much content. So we've got uh, mathematics based uh, revision questions, we've got uh, physics, we've got uh, chemistry, then we've got also topic based uh, section for all the subjects. And this is uh, the best uh, section for you if you're having any challenges in uh, any particular topic.